Hello, welcome to 42 Super Nerd, and today we're decomposing the hypochlorous acid made in a previous video into hydrochloric, or HCl, and chloric acid, which is a more oxidized version of hypochlorous. That's one more oxygen group. And so we have a water bath, we have a floating in this water bath, solution of it in our jar, sealed so that it keeps in the hydrochloric acid, and we'll react with the water in there. So we're heating this slowly and giving it below 200 degrees Celsius, 100 degrees Celsius, or 212 degrees Fahrenheit by keeping it in the water, that way then the glass will not be Okay, here is the pre- full reaction before it's decomposed with baking soda. A little bit of a reaction. But when it disproportionates, it'll form I mean it's done dissolving and stuff, it'll leave behind salt and sodium hypochlorite. You can test that and it'll react with ammonia a certain way and make hydrazine and chloramine. Now you can smell the pool chlorine still, which means it has not fully finished the reaction. Hello, well, welcome back to the video. Here we are. It's been uh, up to 75 degrees Celsius. I've heated this up to in the sealed container. It's already spewing me a little bit of hydrochloric acid. So I know partially the reaction has taken place. Here's the same amount of um, sodium bicarbonate. And here we go much slower reaction because it's releasing the energy faster and it is released about the same amount 